Deschutes County Commissioners are considering adopting a safe parking program, which allows people to live in their cars in designated areas. Kelsey McGee looks at what's in the works. A meeting today focused on discussing the possibilities for safe parking in the county, so no vote was taken. Commissioners are looking to other programs for guidance. Safe parking is one piece of uh, that strategy to create uh, authorized, planned, managed, uh, structured places for people uh, to go um, to help them take steps out of homelessness. Deschutes County Commissioners heard from staff about adopting a safe parking program for the county outside of city limits Wednesday morning. Such programs already exist in parts of Deschutes County. The uh, safe parking concept has worked in the, in the city of Bend and Redmond. Uh, it's kind of a managed uh, two, four, or six RV type camps uh, in a, maybe a church parking lot or behind a business. Uh, and we really trying to figure out do we have that opportunity at Deschutes County. A staff report outlined three options. One is the status quo, not to adopt a safe parking program. Option two is to draft a safe parking program within the urban growth boundaries. That would be outside of um, the urban growth boundaries of Ben and Redmond. And option three is to adopt a program that goes beyond the urban growth boundaries. Deschutes County is able to create a safe parking program inside an urban growth boundary, according to House Bill 2006. But there's uncertainty about whether safe parking would be allowed in the unincorporated parts of the county outside the urban growth boundary. The board asked staff to come back with two possibilities for the safe parking program. One is to allow commissioners to approve safe parking sites within an urban growth boundary, and the second would be within one mile outside an urban growth boundary. The possibilities will be drafted and then presented for board consideration. Both the city of Redmond and Ben have those programs that are, are successful, so we'll be looking at, at those programs to model them after those existing programs that are successful. The City of Bend Safe Parking Program allows overnight camping. The property must be owned by a business or nonprofit, and there's no formal city authorization required. There's also transitional overnight parking in Bend, requiring case management or supervision. The city manager approves or denies applications. In Redmond, the Safe Parking Program is operated by religious organizations, nonprofits, and is limited to up to six vehicles. The property owner applies and has to get approval from the Community Development Department. Two possibilities are being considered in case one isn't approved by commissioners, the other could move forward. And there will likely be a public hearing for people to testify. Kelsey McGee, News Channel 21.